at the end of June, we had a virtual town hall meeting with our faculty and staff. And I wanted to have this meeting after talking with my HR director because we were very concerned about the population of faculty and staff that we have that are 59 years old or older. And so we have about 34% of our uh, faculty and staff that are 59 years old or older. And as we all have heard since the pandemic started, that there is an at-risk age group um, as we think about COVID-19. And so providing them with the proper information to make the right decision as it pertains to their own health situation and any concerns around contracting COVID-19, um, but also continuing in their positions uh, was something that was very important to us to be able to have those conversations. So within the town hall meeting, we set up a hotline um, where uh, faculty and staff can ask questions of HR, ask questions of any of the administration at the university in regards to their particular situation. But one thing that I have encouraged is we must communicate. This is a time that communication is so important. And I've said this to my vice chancellors, to our middle management on campus. You have to listen to your employees, your team. Um, and if there is someone who is concerned, if there is someone who is in the at-risk age group and needs some type of accommodation uh, to help them fulfill their job requirements, but also to make them feel safe, then we need to look at that on a case-by-case -case basis. And so we've been very clear um, around communication because you don't know if you don't know. And so we want our faculty and staff to feel free to come to us, to come to their managers, to talk to them about their particular situation. And we work within the HR guidelines to make sure that they have whatever necessary for them to be successful, but also uh, putting the wellness and well-being of our campus community as our top priority.